Today, Kevin and I have some new and limited edition cookies, wafers to try from Vortman's. Uh, Vortman's sent us, actually they sent us a big box of, of uh, holiday treats to try for you and I divided it, I'm divided it into two videos. So this is one of two. Uh, in this one, we're gonna be trying wafers. So these are the eggnog wafers. These are a candy cane. Can I have the chocolate milk? And the chocolate mint we have uh, tried in the past. There's a video up of them. Yeah, but they say um, now made with milk and eggs. Yeah, so I don't know if the ones before that we tried were made with milk and eggs. I don't remember that being on the package. Um, or it may they may have made them with milk and eggs, and for some reason, it's a thing now that they're putting on the package. So we're just going to try them out. Yeah, so, now. So it seems like it would be new. Something different, yeah. So we figured we would try them this, again. This package has been squashed a little bit because the ends, I can feel them there. It's going to oh. be very crumbly. Well, I'll open, open this end because that end looks bigger and than this It's a little bit end. better on this end. So. Okay. Well, and it'll be fun to compare the candy cane to the mint. Mm -hmm. um, so, see what the difference is. yeah, we'll see. So, eggnog flavored waff, uh, wafers baked with real nutmeg. This classic holiday beverage inspired snack has a rich and creamy flavor in a 10.6 ounce package. Uh, no artificial colors or flavors, no high, high fructose corn syrup, new limited edition. Love the package. Three wafers, 30 grams is 150 calories. I bet you they're all like that. What is it? 150? Three is 150. 150, yeah. 150. Uh, and this is a Canadian company. So um, this uh, Bortman is one of our favorite Canadian companies. Yeah. So, Especially for wafers. Yes. Uh, and if you don't know this about Kevin and I, if this is your first time watching one of our videos, <laughs> We love eggnog. That's what oh, that's I was gonna say. Beyond smell good. We love eggnog. Um, eggnog is awesome. I could keep those in the cabinet and eat them. Now Kevin's gonna want to go out and buy mm. eggnog. No, because I could eat probably half this package for the same calories in one glass of eggnog. <laughs> Mm -mm. Eggnog is so full of calories and You know what? You're right. Mm -hmm. um, you can literally cut this package in half and probably eat half of it. Oh, absolutely. Then then compared to yolk and to eggnog though. If you got one glass of eggnog, literally you're I heard a thousand that. calories. I heard that years ago. They said on the radio, they said eggnog is one of the worst things that you can drink. Sorry to spoil your fun this holiday season. Uh, it's full of fat. So this is the answer to everything. It's very, very good. <laughs> it really is because that is awesome. Mm -hmm. it's, it's it's one of the better eggnogs we've had, especially cookie form. I think it is probably the best cookie. The best, eggnog. yeah. This is the best eggnog cookie I've had. Mm -hmm. Yes, that because they Bortman truly captured the genuine flavor of eggnog yeah. the not richness only, and not only just the spice yeah it seems like you're getting that rich creamy mm -hmm. kind of uh, yes. flavor too it's perfect yeah, yeah. It's really, really that, that's awesome they did an excellent job um so these are the candy cane My baked, candy canes too. <laughs> baked with real peppermint oil now you can while i'm opening this tell our candy cane story when we lived in the apartment oh we we you, one year we, we were we didn't have a lot of money we didn't have a lot of money so we were trying to decorate the christmas tree so we put like candy canes all over the tree and they didn't have wrappers but they weren't there. individually wrapped yeah they were just candy canes yeah so we got we didn't get a leak the neighbor got a leak from their washing machine and it leaks of course you're in an apartment building it leaks everywhere so we had water all down in our, in our basement or our lower floor and uh, they were trying to dry it out and the moisture from all that water drying out uh, made all the candy canes melt. They, you look at the Christmas tree and these candy canes were melting. It was a yeah, very was sad, sad looking Christmas tree with these melting candy canes. I'm trying to get some out of the center. They smell good. They smell strong. Yeah. Because the edges, uh, they don't put like cardboard around them, which is good. It's not wasting packaging, but sometimes the edges get a little beat up a little bit. The red. 
It's so night and day going from eggnog to candy mm -hmm. cane. Yeah, well, they're good and sweet, uh, candy cane, though. It does remind you of eating a candy cane. It's not quite as strong as a candy cane, but it's nice because it's sweeter. Their wafers are hmm. stellar. They are. If, if you have passed these packages in the store, and they're located in several different places, at least in our Walmart. I don't know why, but normally they're up like, there's some like up near the freezer section sometimes on an end cap. Yeah, just hanging on a rack really. Maybe not yeah, anything. and then you'll see them um, in the, the cookie aisle too. Um, but if you've passed on their wafers, you have to really try them. And I'm not saying this because they sent them to me either. If you We've go back and watch any <laughs> of our Vortman, I've always bragged on Vortman. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. And that is a true candy cane flavor. Yeah, but I like it that it's sweet. It's mm -hmm. not a, it's a sweet candy cane, not a strong candy cane. I have a feeling these are gonna be a stronger minty. Kind of I know. Flavor. I don't know what we said before. Taste change. We, you know, we, we, I don't know what we said before, but mm. I do know that taste change. Do you want a different one? No, it's fine. Oh, okay. Like I said, the ends do get kind of beat up a little bit. And mine was coming apart, but that's okay. Mm -hmm. This one was too. I tell you what, one of the first flavors I get of that is chocolate, mm -hmm. which is good. Now, I don't remember what I said before. That one I would not get again. Mm -hmm. I don't care for that. It's not bad. I do. I I don't care for it. I don't care for the mint. It's not bad. It's not one I would go. I would grab. There's so many other brands or flavors that they have that I would rather have. Mm -hmm. That that this is not one I would choose. But it reminds you. It's like it's completely different than like even an Andes or anything like that. It's just different. Mm -hmm. No, it does not taste like a York or Andes or after eight or no it doesn't really taste like that no uh junior mint it doesn't taste like any of those the the mint the mint is sharper and it, i think it's with that chocolate it's sharper and it comes off as there's just there's something that's sharp and bitter to me in mm -hmm. that and that i i love the wafer the texture is five out of five texture i mean they, they're awesome but i just don't like the flavor yeah I don't mind them. It, like I said, it wouldn't be one I'd choose. I'd much rather have the candy cane. Uh, the, yes, the candy cane, it's night and day. If you're wondering if there's any difference, absolutely night and day. Yeah, the candy cane different. tastes like a candy cane. This, I just don't care for it. Now, this is the best thing here. The eggnog one. Yeah. The eggnog, I'm telling <laughs> you, are stellar. And if you have always been, if you're one of these people that you've picked up the eggnog and you've been like, whoa, I'm not buying that, I'm not trying it because the calories are too much, buy these. I promise you, it's the it'll same the, flavor. It'll hit the buttons for you. Yeah, it will. It will. It, you're, or if you avoid eggnog because you know that you're going to drink the whole thing in one go, um, <laughs> um, then th this is the way to go. I'm telling you, these are perfection. Mm, they're very good. Yeah. So. And if you ever come across their strawberry banana, that's the best one we've yes. ever had. But yeah. But they, but they don't hardly, I don't, we don't see them around here anymore. No, so they may no. have been making them. Yeah. Um, I tell you what though, now that I've had these eggnog. Eggnog's eggnog, pretty good. But yes, out of, out of all the Bortman wafers that we've tried, um, the strawberry banana, yeah, it's it's up there. It's one mm. of the top. And we've done reviews too of a lot of of, of all their sugar free cookies. Mm -hmm. um, so the sugar free varieties, we have those on the channel too. I have a playlist. Of, um, I'm I'm thinking I have a Bortman playlist. I also have a Canadian playlist. So they may just be under Canada. I'm not sure. Uh, but I'll have a picture of each of these for you at the end. And thanks for watching.